How did a gentle, friendly pooch trained to care for patients in need end up on the street alone and in pain? Good evening, I'm Chris Flanagan. And I'm Danita Harris. News Channel 5's Deborah Lee is live in our newsroom tonight. Deb, what's the latest on this story? You know, it's a mystery tonight. It's not often that you find dogs used in pet therapy roaming the streets like a stray. Foxy Lady here is a therapy dog, but when Jennifer Copley found her late Wednesday afternoon, the dog wasn't cheering up patients in a hospital or nursing home. She was wandering aimlessly through the streets of Cleveland. Jen spotted her around 105th and Carnegie. I chased her all the way to 89th and Cedar. It's illegal to abandon a dog in Ohio, but whether this dog was actually abandoned, no one's really sure. Therapy dogs are trained to comfort patients. Sometimes they're even used in schools. Jen hoped the phone number on the therapy tag would be a clue to this dog's ownership, but it was a dead end. They only keep photos of dogs from the current year, so they only have photos of dogs from 2012, and her tag said 2008. So she's been a therapy dog since 2008. She's had her bot mitzvah already. Dr. William Mandel says Foxy Lady's a teenager and she's in a lot of pain. Notice the constant shaking. So I think most of that is just weakness from pain. And when she's laying down, she's okay. It's just when she's trying to stand, it's just so weak. She's probably been just walking the streets for however long and those old bones are just sore. Dogs like Foxy Lady have a habit of crossing Jen's path. She rescued five strays last year, including Chester, who'd been left in a trash can on Chester Avenue. Chester was adopted, and if Foxy Lady's owner isn't found, Jen hopes she'll be adopted too. Now, if you would like more information about Foxy Lady, or if you think you might even know who this dog is, please go to the story on our website, newsnet5.com. In the newsroom, Deborah Lee. News Channel 5.